Like many Marines during lunch hours, Sergeant Philip Gore found himself at the gym. But this time, he wasn't there to pump iron. He was there to pump blood. Bleeding good. Just keep squeezing. Each Marine who took part in the United Blood Services blood drive at Marine Corps Air Station Yuma on August 23rd had their own special reason for donating, including Gore, who had personal experience inspiring him. I think donating blood is, a, is, is really a lifesaver, and I'm not saying this, but I'm saying it from experience because just last December, my brother had to get 11 uh, blood transfusions, so what I'm doing could help somebody just like it helped my brother last year. The donations by Gore and Marines just like him will eventually save lives. If you get a chance to, to do something to make a difference in somebody else's life, especially save a life, definitely don't pass it up. Take, take advantage of that. It's important to know the blood donated is not transferred to other states. It actually stays in Arizona and can save a life at the local hospital, giving directly back to the Yuma community. And every donation saves up to three lives. And Yuma Regional Hospital uses um, blood. They do 800 transfusions a month just to meet their needs of blood supply here in Yuma. Continual participation at these blood drives shows a commitment to saving lives that Marines are famous for, all by simply donating a pint of blood. Corporal Zachary Scanlon, Marine Corps Air Station, Yuma.